from the book of the prophet Isaiah. On this mountain, the Lord of hosts will provide for all peoples a feast of rich food and choice wines, juicy, rich food, and pure, choice wines. On this mountain, he will destroy the veil that veils all people, the web that is woven over all nations. He will destroy death forever. The Lord God will wipe away the tears from all faces. The reproach of his people he will remove from the whole earth, for the Lord has spoken. On that day it will be said, Behold our God to whom we looked to save us. This is the Lord for whom we looked. Let us rejoice and be glad that he has saved us. For the hand of the Lord will rest on this mountain, but Moab will be trodden down as a straw is trodden down in the mire. He will stretch forth his hands in Moab as a swimmer extends his hands to swim. He will bring low their pride as his hands sweep over them. The high-walled fortress he will raise and strike down level with the earth, with the very dust. On that day they will sing this song in the land of Judah. A strong city have we, he sets up walls and ramparts to protect us, open up the gates to let in a nation that is just, one that keeps faith, a nation of firm purpose you keep in peace, in peace for its trust in you. Trust in the Lord forever, for the Lord is an eternal rock. He humbles those in high places, and the lofty city he brings down. He tumbles it to the ground, levels it with the dust. It is trampled underfoot by the needy, by the footsteps of the poor. Let us pray. Loving Father, we seek the simplicity of your love in the midst of our complex lives. Teach us to be able to know the difference between what we need and what we want. May your wisdom guide us in our search and in our actions. We pray through Jesus Christ and in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen.